Well, about a lot of folks are sleeping in this morning, but if you do happen to step outside, we are working with a little bit of fog out there and some cold temperatures. So dense fog in Portland and mostly on the east sides and extending out towards the gorge this morning time. So if you are driving or walking, take it a little bit slower um, around some corners out there. Temperatures in the mid 30s for many spots, not dealing with freezing fog out this morning in the Portland metro area, but some spots out towards battleground and further up into the uh, hills there could see some freezing fog. PDX now sitting at 33 degrees. Very cold start here in downtown Portland with that big fog layer over us now. Up north Kelso, 34 degrees, a little bit colder as you work your way up the I-5 corridor there. Not too much fog in that region, but today we could still see some of that fog developing in spots here, likely lifting by the late morning hours and into our lunchtime. So we are tracking some showers that are just offshore. These will likely work in through the late morning about uh, lunchtime here out for the coast, but in Portland we are dry now. We'll likely stay dry until our later evening. That'll be our chance for some rain back in Portland. So we're tracking this front here that'll scoot towards the east and bring the chance for showers in Portland by tonight. It's also a second system just offshore. You can see that spinning away there. That'll likely fall towards the south and bring some more rain into northern California. But here's our future cast again. This model now bringing rainfall towards the late morning out towards the beaches here. So some wet weather today through the afternoon for the coast. By the evening time, this front scoots over and we could get some rain in Portland. Likely looking at some light rain showers tonight around 7 to 8 p.m. and into those overnight hours here. We'll also stay fairly cold too, so the mountains may be looking at uh, one to two more inches of snow and out in the gorge today and uh, through the overnight hours into Wednesday morning rather, we could see some freezing rain potential because temperatures will be just near freezing um, out towards the surface, a little warmer aloft. So as that rain falls, it, we could get some mixed precipitation. So not expecting much accumulation. The system does work out pretty quickly. We dry up as we head into our Christmas day and we stay dry the rest of the week. So here's our rain chances in Portland going into today. Some showers by tonight. Maybe a few showers trickle over into Christmas Day, but I think we'll stay fairly dry there. And then Thursday and Friday, we are dry too. So looking at to mostly cloudy skies the rest of the week, but today we could see some rain. The coast, of course, we'll see that earlier in the day as that front works in. So temperatures out towards the beaches, mid to upper 40s. We'll see some rain here by the afternoon with a mainly cloudy day. Dense fog to start here in the valley and mostly for the Portland metro area. That fog should lift by the late morning, but we'll see increasing clouds and then the chance for some evening rain. Rainfall. Out towards central and eastern Oregon, low 40s today. Notice those overnight lows also in the 20s. Very cold out there. We could see some light to evening flurries here. Not expecting much accumulation. And then in the gorge overnight, that uh, wintry mix possible. Don't think we'll see too many issues on the roadways. Even out towards government camp, uh, likely not seeing too much snow there too. Uh, travel should be okay up and over the mountains through Christmas. Uh, so here's that seven day forecast. Temperatures stay fairly chilly this week. Low to mid 40s. Christmas Day will go with 45 degrees. Portland and a mostly dry day. Temperatures overnight, though, will be near freezing almost every morning here this week. Back to you guys. All right. Thank you, Kelly.